This is going to be the air squat and the goblet squat. Whenever we set up our squat, we want to set our feet first. When we set our feet, we want our feet to be slightly outside hip width or shoulder width. So I set my feet shoulder width position. I want my toes to be straight or turned out slightly. I set my hands out in front. I'm going to break at the knees, sit back to the heels, keeping my chest tall when I squat, separating my knees when I go down. So I break at the knees, separate knees, keep the chest up nice and tall, drop my hips, knees out, chest up, sit back, sit back, sit back, all the way down, and then I push to a stand, keeping my chest tall the whole time. A lot of times when we squat, our knees are going to want to go in. There's two pinnacle times when they want to do that. When I start the movement, they're going to want to shoot in, or when I'm coming from the bottom position and up. So, for example, when I squat, if my knees are going in like this, I want to push my knees out over my ankles and try to keep them there and drop my hips all the way down. The other time they want to, going to want to come in is when I push up from the bottom. If I push up, my knees shoot in, I want to push my knees out over my ankles. My knees should close and open like a door or a hinge movement. You want the knees to open and close, stay out over the ankles. The other thing that typically happens when we first start squatting is our heels want to come off the ground. If our heels are coming off the ground, grab a couple of plates. These are two big 10 pound plates. You don't have to have the big ones, you can have the small ones as well. As long as our heels are elevated evenly and not too high. I'm going to set my feet in shoulder width position, just having my heels on the plates. I want my toes to be turned out slightly. For the goblet squat, we're going to pick up a dumbbell. I've got a 15 pound dumbbell. When we set up, feet first, feet set, dumbbell stays close to our chest, our elbows stay in tight. We break at the knees, sit back to the heels, keep the chest up tall, chest up tall, separate knees all the way down, and then we push to the heels to the sand, making sure our knees open and close. As far as depth goes, we want to make sure we're going all the way down, a full range of motion for healthy joints. So I set my feet, I want my hip joint to go below my knee joint for a full squat. Break at the knees, sit back, back stays flat, heels stay down, chest stays tall, I go all the way down, and then I push to a stand. That's the goblet squat and the air squat.